Hello. Hello. What's your name? My full name is Nguyễn Thị Thúy. Okay, that's great. How are you today, please? Mm, I feel great. Mm, okay, so how old are you? I'm... I'm 11. <laughs> but, uh, uh, I'm 16 years old. Okay, now, so we are going to take the speaking test, right? Okay? So okay. there are three parts in total. And uh, let us start with speaking part one. Tell me, what do you often do in your free time? Mm, uh, when I have a lot of time, I uh, I love like learning Koreans mm. because um, I I have fashion fashion for K-pop and um, uh, another reason to I want to like watch Korean movie without Vietnamese subtitle. Let's talk a little bit about language. Okay. How many languages can you speak? Mm, I can speak three languages. Mm -hmm. It's Vietnamese, English, and Korean. Mm -hmm. Okay. So, uh, I want to know a little bit about lang English. Okay. So how you feel with English to you in the future? Uh, sorry? How you feel English be to you in your future? Uh, how how useful it is? What can it do for you? Uh, I think English gives me a lot of uh, like opportunity for me to uh, uh, like miss international friend, and I can communicate with them. Another. Another, I can like get a good job in the future okay. with a good salary. All right, that's great. What do you remember about learning language at school? Um, Is there anything memorable um, when you learn English or another language at school? I think. Um, and mem memorable is um, my English teacher is uh, very nice enthusiastic and um, she's uh, always like um, she's always willing to help uh, to give me a having hands when I have a trouble with uh, English so I think it's I think it's your um mm, no, I'm very like a is yes. okay, got it. What do you think would be the hardest language for you to learn? Mm. What is the most difficult language to learn, do you think? Um, I think I think it's uh, I think this is Korean mm -hmm. because uh, you know it's different it's different from us uh, from like Vietnamese or English and um, so it's um so I think it's uh, is a uh, like um a strange thing does um just make me make me let's uh make me um makes me um nervous <laughs> yes I just nervous and uh, I I'm not confident when com I communicate. Mm -hmm. Okay, I see. But I do think that if you have a in the future, you still can try to learn Korean, right? Yes. Okay, thank you very much. Now, so we move to speak in part two, all right? Um, in this part, I will give you a cue card, all right? The question is, describe a website that you would like to bought to buy something from that okay so you better say what the website is what you bought from that website 
how you satisfied or how you are happy when the, with what you bought from that, okay? And, and explain what you like on this level. It. You have one minute to get prepared and do some paper and you can make some notes. Later on, we'll have two minutes and so So, one minute start now. So one minute is over. You now have two minutes to talk. Right? Okay. So, um, and uh, don't worry if I stop you. Okay, let's go. Uh, okay. So I I would like to talk about the website as uh, I bought a lot of things. Mm. This is Sophie. Sophie. Yes, you know this is as uh, uh, it's a like well-known website in Vietnam and um and um, it's uh, like um have a lot of things from us uh, clothes to um to us uh, like uh, like um, clothes and uh things that you need to cook and, and I, I can say this I uh, as I really uh, like I love I like this website I, I use and um, like twice in twice days a week and um, there, there is um, there's there's um, there are lots of clothes that I really love. I I buy it in Shopee. As for example, is for example is in my like my uh, as my um. Um. Oh, I. Um. But as uh, uh, you know, everything in Sophie's is available, and you can um, buy it anytime. Mm -hmm. But uh, sometimes there are um, many people. Okay. Do you like buying T-shirts at uh, Sophie? Yes. 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 Do you have your favorite shirts from shopping? Um, yes, I, yes, I have. Hmm. Okay. Thank you very much. I can see that it's very useful for you, right? Okay. Thank you. Now, so now we move to speaking part three, and I will ask you some question about online shopping. <laughs> okay. What kind of thing do people in your country often buy? from online shop? Mm, I think people uh, usually buy like clothes in 
uh, in websites in some websites of uh, what kind of thing that people can buy a lot um, people's people can buy a lot of things uh, like clothes food or and or why do you think that shopping online has become so popular nowadays mm, i think because it's very like convenient mm. yes it is um because people can buy any 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 time but um Mm. And I think it's uh, as so you can tell more about the advantage of online shopping. And it's um, it's um, like some. I think people don't waste uh, their time to uh, go to go to sh- go to shopping, but they also can can shop on your f- on your on your phone. Um, and another thing is. In the like shopping online is have everything. Um, and so, is there any possible disadvantages of buying thing on online shop? Mm, I think. I think it's. Is it everything good? Is it anything that's not good? Mm. It's um, it brings a lot of like benefits, but it's is also have uh, some disadvantages, like as uh, when your Wi-Fi is not can. In not connected, so you, so you couldn't buy. It. Mm-hmm. What else? And um. Do you like shopping online? <laughs> um. No, I think and <laughs> it depends on uh, context. You know, mm-hmm. when I when I can. When I can shopping with my friends, is I really friends with um, friends. The I really love is but when I like go shopping with my father, uh, with my mother, she okay, it's not very really interesting in shopping. Yeah. Okay. So thank you very much. Thank you. That is the end of speaking test. Right?